I'm gonna start cleansing Angelica's skin with this micelle water. It's so delicious. It has colloidal silver in it. So I do this every time to cleanse the client's skin. And then I'm gonna spray this delicious young blood minerals in a mist. This just helps refresh the skin and hydrate it for a perfect application. And then I'm going to go in with this Youngblood Illuminator with Diamond Powder. I love this stuff. It has a perfect little glow to it. So then I mix the Youngblood Liquid Mineral Foundation in Sunkiss and Golden Tan along with the Diamond Illuminator. So I mix it on the pan here. I'm just going in with their fluffy foundation brush. I kind of like to start in the middle and just work my way out. Angelica has beautiful skin, so I don't want to add too much coverage. And this mineral foundation is like the perfect amount. And then I'm going in with their ultimate concealer. This is a pretty peachy color, so it cancels out any blue tones. And then the yellow here cancels out any purple. So I'm just going to kind of mix these together and press it in with my finger, not getting it too close to the lash line. And then on top of the eye, I'm going in with their Stay Put, Youngblood Stay Put Eye Primer. I'm just gonna do a little bit on my finger. Light Rice Mineral Powder. I'm just gonna set those eyes with a little bit of that powder before I apply the eyeshadow. And then I'm going to go in with the Enchanted Youngblood palette. I'm going to use the color Bonfire, Teas, and Beaches, and Cream. I'm going to start with this one in the crease. And go underneath the eye as well to tie it all in together. And I'm going to take the Beaches and Cream color from this Youngblood YB9 brush. I'm going to put this right in the inner corner. And on the same brush, I'm going to take the color Tease. And I'm just going to put that right on top of the Beaches and Cream. It's going to give it a beautiful rose gold tone. And then from this Weekender palette from Youngblood, I'm taking the color Adventure. And I'm just going to outline where I'm going to make my wing liner. So that it's just one easy step to do before so that you don't mess up. Now that I have the outline of the eye, I'm going to go in with the Youngblood Eye Amazing Liquid Liner Pen. And I'm just going to start slowly with little brush strokes to fill in that outline. To clean up underneath, I'm just going to use the micelle water and take a little tip. And this one was a little lower, so I'm just going to wipe that away. So I already went in and did the mascara and the concealer, and now I'm coming in with the translucent HD powder. Just going just very lightly underneath that to give a nice airbrush look. Some warmth into Angelica's face. I'm gonna use the Soleil bronzer. I'm just gonna go right underneath the cheekbones, the hollows of the cheek. Over the top of the forehead. So now I'm going in with the cheek color Posh, just on the apples of the cheek. A little bit on the forehead, a little bit on the nose. A little sun-kissed look. So now I'm going in with their Mineral Radiance in Sundance. This is just a really pretty glow. It's a mix of blush, bronzer, and highlight. And I just like to do this right on top of both the bronzer and the cheek to kind of play it all together. Brows. This is the Brow Artiste in Brunette. Just going to add a little bit of definition to the brows on top. And I'm going in with the Youngblood All Natural Lip Pencil. I'm just going to define. Angelica has beautiful lips. I'm just going to put this lip liner over the entire lip. All right, so I finished putting the lip liner all over the lips in All Natural, and now I'm going in with the Barely Nude. This is gonna go just right in the center of her lips. It's a little bit lighter of a color, so this will help 
make the lips pop. This is the Illuminate palette. It's their highlighting. And look at all these beautiful colors. I'm gonna probably mix these three. It's gorgeous. I'm just gonna put it on my fingertips. And then I'm just gonna dab right on the top of her cheekbones. Now for the body, I mixed oil with Illuminator. All of those together in my palm. I'm gonna put it straight onto her body for a nice, beautiful, glowy, bronzy look. And even onto her shoulders. This gives you like a nice looking natural tan. It's like kind of sun-kissed and glowy. 